Hello guys, welcome back to the Bollum channel. Um, welcome if you're new and to everybody that's become a bit of a regular already because we haven't been going very long. Um, thank you for supporting us. Um, today we have an unboxing and today we have Birchbox. Actually I say today, we're doing several unboxings for you. But as I explained in the previous video, um, we do actually film several videos in one go and we stagger how we upload them so you get to see a video every other day or that's the aim anyway um because um with the health issues i have i can't be in front of the camera regularly so when i am okay to film i do several in one go just so that you get that like regular upload from us and you don't wonder where we've gone to it would generally be because i'm ill but i found a way that suits me and all of you guys so you get to see my ugly mug more regularly <laughs> um, yeah so um we have a few unboxings um as as i explained in the previous video which was the lol doll um uh, yeah unboxing it, it it wasn't a very boxy shape um we had a lot of fun with that we will link that video we did say in that video that um we're not dirty people if you see us it, um in, in these regular uploads for this particular week um wearing the same clothes it's not because we're dirty and we don't wash our clothes we clean our clothes every single day. It's just that we have filmed several videos, one after the other. Um, yeah, so obviously we're wearing the same thing. We're, just, we're not mingers, we, we do wash our clothes. We don't smell. No. No, no, no. <laughs> well, if we do, it's nice, honestly. Yeah. Um, so, we do have a bo an unboxing for you. We have a birch box. Now, this is something I've had before. Um, and now we've started our channel, I decided it might be nice to share this with you. I mean, some people will have it and enjoy watching others unbox it like I do. Ooh. I do like a spoiler. This is late, obviously, because I have collected them up. I've been quite poorly. Um, so I've accumulated four of the boxes from this month. So it is late. We are almost at the end of the month and I'm showing you February's box. This is not March's box. This is February's, okay, guys? So um, I haven't looked at them. So everything you see will be a very real reaction by all of us. Mm -hmm. um, the girls have no idea what's in them. I've seen no. spoilers for everything because I'm very, very nosy at times. Uh, this month Not I, me, but... yeah, no, I know what's inside and it's been torture not opening them, but I felt oh. it was a good idea to show you. Um, I did know what's in them, but I can't remember. <laughs> so it'll kind of be a bit of a surprise. I'll open it and I won't be like, oh yes, I didn't remember that. Um, yeah, I'm not going to be quite like that. It'd be like, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. I remember that. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I don't know. But, but with the birch box, um, you can't know what's in there. Sometimes you will know one of the products because you've chosen it. Um, each month, birch box email you with a choice. Now, that choice could be uh, uh, between two products. Um, for example, you might get the choice between a lip tint or a lipstick. Um, they might be slightly different colours and you will have the option to choose that. It may be that they've got two different box designs for that particular month and you get to choose the design of your box. So you have to respond to that email um, quite quickly. I think there's a time limit on it. I'm not sure how long that time limit is. Um, don't quote me on that. Uh, but I think you've got a limited amount of time. You can choose either, either of the options or you can leave it as a surprise. There is three options. You get to choose either one or the third option is surprise me. Now I tend to choose it because I can't bear, <laughs> I can't bear this surprise. I like to know one of the items I'm getting inside. I, you know. Honestly, I would probably do surprise me because it'd be more like. Ooh. I wish I could be like that. <laughs> But anyway, so, um, I I can't remember if I picked the item or not this time. I can't honestly remember. I don't remember. <laughs> so I don't actually know what's inside here. As you can see, the box is still 
still sealed okay so i'm going to open this box um this box co is a cosmetics monthly subscription it's sent out once a month it's 12.95 including postage and packaging um so this is billed I, I believe at the beginning of the month probably the first week of the month and then they're dispatched after that um i don't think it's a set day they tend to do it as close to as they can um i haven't noticed a regular pattern maybe that's just me um yeah so it's 12.95 per month you can there are other options of doing like a three month or a six month i believe um and the more you plan to do the cheaper the each box price comes down if that makes any real sense to you um so yeah. the more boxes you order in one go the cheaper they become um yeah, generally that, that generally i mean I, I i may have it wrong but that seems to be what i've noticed with most monthly subscription boxes this is a ladies box it generally comes with um things like makeup and skincare and you know things for your hair and, and and that sort of thing okay so it is for a lady i do have a refer code if you would like to get your first box slightly cheaper um you don't have to use this code um i do benefit from it and so do you so the refer code i will link afterwards um the refer code i've written everything on the box because i couldn't possibly remember so the refer code gives us both five pound off now the five pound put is put into my account so i can use in the birch box shop i believe and the five pound for you comes off of your box so you will get your box five pound cheaper and i will gain five pound to spend in the shop um, like I said, it's up to you. You don't need to use the code, but I will link it in case you would like to use it. Okay, so without further ado, let's have a look. Let's get so I've got to be really careful because if you're not careful with opening the box, you don't want to be damaging the box because generally they're quite beautiful. Um, they are generally themed boxes, like the actual box itself. I believe these ones are... Um, based on based on the past in that you could choose an, an 80s design box a 90s design box and i can't remember the third option i think there was three ah oh, now wow. if i'm not mistaken it looks like i've got the 80s so i would assume oh. i actually chose this box it might have been amazing okay so here is the box I'm, I'm quite convinced now I pulled it out that I did actually choose this one. Now it's a drawer, so it comes out, okay? And I, I don't know about anyone else, because um, I've had this for several months now, I stack these one on top of the other on my dressing table, and I use them to put my costume jewellery in. You could put makeup in them, or if you're not keen, you can chuck them. But if you've got children and you're not keen, um, your children would probably enjoy them. I mean, I've, I've given some boxes to my children. They love using them as much as I do. They're quite a handy little storage. So I'm going to pull this out and show you guys before I see. You get to see inside my box. Have a good look. What do you think of that, guys? Does it look good? Okay. Right, so there's generally a leaflet inside explaining things. I think sometimes they share with you um, prices of things. Most of the items are generally trial sizes. You don't often get much in the way of full sizes, but the products are really good. If you enjoy the products, generally you can buy these trial size products in a full size from their site. So those five pounds that people um manage to credit your account if they've used your code go towards treating yourself which is quite nice obviously um you know it might help towards the cost of something you would have been buying in the shops elsewhere um and, and it helps you to afford it slightly cheaper so yeah so i'm gonna dig in i'm gonna pull one item out at a time and we're gonna have a look okay right so the first thing I'm going to pull out 
is a coconut, it's called Lucetta or Lucetta. I don't know how to pronounce this. It's not a brand I've ever come across before. It's coconut milk hair mask. And it's meant to be a nourishing and moisturizing, color safe, and it's free of sulfates, paraben, and gluten. And it's for normal and dry hair. Now my hair is very, very dry. So that sounds like it could be an interesting thing to try. That'd so that's what it looks well. like. That'd be yeah. really good for you actually. Yeah. It's quite a good product. Yeah, it's quite, good. it's quite um, a large size tube for, a, I mean, it must be a trial size yeah. and it's 30 milliliters so it's quite a decent size um, I'm just gonna see if I can pull the leaflet out to see if there's anything we can reach show you so this is the leaflet that's in the bottom of the box now if you don't want uh, if you don't like spoilers please look away now okay right so on the back of the leaflet it has a sneak peek for March's box. This is the choices you um, you get, like I was explaining previously, you get to choose between two items. Now this is March's, okay? Um, I've already done this, I've already seen the email, I have picked my item. This item here is a face mask, a black, I think it's a charcoal face mask, yeah. a peel off type face mask this is something i already have this has been in a box previously i don't think it was birch box but i do have one this is hydrogel eye masks now i don't have this and i would love to try it so this is the one i've ordered okay so you get the choice on the back of the leaflet and when you open it up it tells you a bit about each product so what i'm going to do is when i pull an item out i'm going to read to you what it says okay so, Lucetta Coconut Milk Hair Mask, which is here. I think you can read that. Yeah. It has an RRP of £32. Now, this isn't a full size. As you can see, it's not a pot, it's a tube. So, this is actually a sample. And it says... Teasing your do into throwback styles might be fun, but between the hairspray and backcombing, your hair will likely be left in need of a little TLC. Enter this nourishing treatment designed to repair and restructure. Apply generously to damp hair after shampooing. Leave for up to five minutes and then rinse away. The mix of fatty acids and vitamins will leave your strands soft, silky and protected, even coloured hair. So that sounds really good. That sounds really good. It does sound really good. Should we have a smell? Mm. Oh, 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 that smells like the centre of a bounty. Oh, I love bounty. Oh, it does smell like that, doesn't it? It smells nice. My favourite. Like that. <laughs> oh. oh, that smells I so nice. I absolutely love bounty. So nice. Ooh. Good yeah. start, Birchbox. Thank you very much. Oh, I'm okay, yeah. so the next item I'm going to pull out and show you is this one. Here you see. And without turning it around, it looks like a repeat offender again with boxes. You do tend to get this if you have them regularly and you have several boxes like I do. You do get repeat offenders. You will double up. Um, you can pass it on to family or friends or you can create a giveaway box and do competitions, which I do do sometimes. So um, keep watching if you would like to... Um, be about for future giveaways we do like a good giveaway don't we we like yeah. to share okay so this is the balance me wonder eye cream and this isn't clearly this isn't a full size i kind of gathered this anyway um because the full size looks like this and the full size is an rrp of 20 pounds and it's um wonder balance me wonder eye cream i don't think i've had this. i think i've had this brand before but not this so this is quite intriguing after all that looking back it's time to show tired eyes a little love yes uh, <laughs> this formula is 99 percent natural something that never gives out never goes out of style sorry about that 
um, but packs a seriously hard working punch. Chamomile, lemon and cucumber oils work together to brighten while coconut, rose hip and carrot oils soften and smooth. Pat a small amount around your eyes morning and night. So it's twice a day. I wonder how long this would actually last. I'll have to give it a good go. Probably quite a while actually because you only need a tiny amount. Well, let's have a look, see what we think of this one. So when it comes out, it's actually white. I expected it to be like a clear gel. I'm gonna tap it into the back of my hand. Ooh. It smells like a kind of like a, a rosy sort of scent, like um, a bit herbal. Mm. Yeah. It is really, really nice. Oh, that is well nice. It smells a bit like impulse. I think it would be um, quite an enjoyable thing to be um, putting on in the morning. Mm. Like quite a, quite a nice get up and go sort of wake up sort of scent. I mean, it's not meant to be put on just for the sake of the scent. Um, this is for tired eyes. But yeah, I'm looking forward to giving that one a try. So the next item we have, it looks, I'm not sure if it's mucky or it's just a, a really dodgy pattern. It looks quite mucky. Um, I can't help but think one of the products I had in there is broken. And we'll come to that before long. Okay. So this is, once again, it's not a full size. I don't think... If, I think it's just... Yeah, this is another sample. Okay, so this is the third item and it's another sample. Okay. It's Percy and Reed, um, quite frankly, flawless finishing polish. Um, and it reads, whether you were rocking a gravity defined perm or please know a mullet. Um, hair was serious business in the 80s. Um, now I don't recall much about the 80s because I was an 80s baby and obviously the girls wouldn't have the vloggiest. Um, today this lightweight styler is packed with horse chestnuts to keep your hair in place without leaving it stiff or greasy and sunflower wax for a gentle injection of moisture. Just work a small amount through hair to smooth and define your finished style and add shine. Sounds good. I think it's actually just dirty. Yeah, I I can't help but think yeah. something else in the box is um, broken. So let's have a, a bit. Once again, this has come out like a creamy colour, like a white colour. But I think I'd have expected it to look like that. So it doesn't look anything different to what I'd have thought. Just going to... Put that on the back of my arm, not on the same place where I put the serum. I can't work out the scent of that. What would you say that smells like? I haven't read the ingredients, so I have no idea. No. It doesn't smell like a bit. It smells a bit like mint or lavender. Uh, let's have a look. Mm. I can't see anything. Flawless in a big word, but this little bottle delivers. This gentle style of containing horse chestnut extract gives you a soft, flexible hold while sunflower wax gently moisturises, knock them dead. Use a pea-sized amount on hair to smooth, control or groom unruly hair. Use a little more to add definition and hold. Okay. I'll have to give that a try then. Mm. I mean, I don't dislike the smell, but I find it odd. I mean, I can't quite figure out what the scent is. I'll have to give it a go. Yeah. It smells quite herby. Mm. It's quite, it is quite weird. Yeah. Okay, so the next item, we won't open this because if you can see, it's smashed. Oh, okay. No. So that'll be why my hair product is dirty because this has come out of the box smashed. Um, 
which has made so this is I'll, I'll read through the description anyway but i'm not going to take the seal off of it because obviously i'm going to need to contact birchbox because um it shouldn't arrive like that i mean it's even as you saw it's coated the hair product with it but anyway this is full size um this is from the beauty crop as you can see on the front there nice shiny mm -hmm. um yeah it's really shiny it, it looks because the light is catching which is rainbow yeah it's quite pretty isn't it mm, I I sit and play with that for ages <laughs> <laughs> right so it says it's full size the rrp of this product is seven pound um and it's a trio of eyeshadow in love you so latte it's obviously brown shades. Love you, Solati. Okay. So it says, Between layers of mascara and heavy slicks of liner, there's no doubt that the 80s were all about the eyes. In fact, the smokier, the better. Now it's time to bring that drama into the 21st century with this collection of eyeshadows. Packed with coffee extracts to brighten. Use all three for a soft, smoky finish or individually to add subtle depth and definition. So something tells me this box has been designed specifically for the 80s. That's the box design and that's the theme of the items inside the box. Um, yeah, so I'd imagine the idea is here is to be making smoky eyes. That must have been a thing of the 80s. I, I couldn't tell you that. I mean, I was too young to be... I wasn't into makeup that young. Also, I was born in 83, so... You know, it's this also wasn't full size, isn't it? Yeah, it is full size. It's not that bad for full size, although it's a shame that it's broken. It looks really good for seven pound. It's something yeah. I think if I got on well with it, it's something I'd probably mm. repurchase. But yeah, it's just a shame it's broken. And the last item in the box, this is something that previously I think we and probably December. I'm quite sure it was December. We had the option of having a red lock or LOC lipstick or a Pixie Petra lip balm. And I chose the lock lipstick, which is quite nice because I've ended up with this anyway. But I really struggled to decide in December which one to have. And now I've got it, which is quite good. It is a full size product. There you go. And it is Shea Butter Lip Balm in Pixie Pink. And it says, if one lip colour defined the 80s, it was fuchsia pink. Oh, jeez. Like, do you know what? I've just filmed a video with us doing these lip tattoos. <laughs> and I've got this bright pink on and it's not me. Like, me and pink aren't best friends, really. Um, if one lip colour defined the 80s, it was fuchsia pink. The Pixie Balm might look a little throwback in the tube, but it has a very modern formula of nourishing shea butter and vitamin E delivering a subtle pink sheen to the lips. Sweep it on for an instant moisture hit or build it up for a more pigmented pout. Right. So it is, yeah, it is full size and it's um, RRP is eight pounds. As you can see, it's worth eight pounds. So it's a very affordable item. It's probably something that if I liked, I would um, repurchase. It looks quite nice. If I can open it, let's have a look. <laughs> You're very quiet. Yeah. Ooh, drop the leaflet as well. Right, okay. A bit tough opening it, but there. That's the colour. And that's how it looks. Quite pretty colour actually. I think it's quite pretty. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, it's got a vanilla scent to it as well. Mmm, it smells good. Oh, that's that's oh. nice. <laughs> you put it your lips. Okay, so. I'm eating it. <laughs> eating it. I can't tot it up because obviously there's out of the five products there is actually um, three samples in there, which makes it very difficult to tot it up. But. Um, there's two full size products in there, which, if I remember correctly, total £15, which means you've made 
you've got more than your box worth in there without the samples anyway so it is value for money um it's a good box it's a shame that the eyeshadow is broken but i shall be contacting birchbox um to see if they can replace that obviously it's quite a nice little trio to um to have so yeah i will link all of the details um i shall put the code in the description box and the link to birchbox website for you to go and have a look if you'd like to um Thank you for watching this video. It was quite good fun having a look at the yeah. items in there. I'm quite pleased with it. Um, yeah, so if you enjoyed this video, please give us a thumbs up. Woo! <laughs> yeah. Um, and if you hit subscribe and the bell button, you will be notified every time we upload another video. Um, thank you. From the Bolland family, goodbye. <laughs>